Scene 2 At Dock of Gulliser's Castle, Edmund enters with a letter. Edmund My father Gulliser says that his first son, Edger, will get his land when he dies. But why should I not have my inheritance? Just because I am 12 or 14 months younger than my brother? Is it just because I am the second son? I am just as strong and kind as my brother, and as clever too. Well, elder brother Edger, I will have your land. Our father loves me, his younger son, as much as he loves you. And I have a letter here. If this letter succeeds, then it won't the younger son will beat the older son Edger. Gulister's enter. Gulister. Ah, Edmond, my son. Have you heard? The king has sent Kent away. And the king of France has left with Cordelia. And the king has left the palace tonight without his powers. This has all happened so quickly. Gulister notices Edmond hiding the letter. What are you doing, Edmond? Edmond. Nothing, father. To Lester. Why are you trying to hide that letter? What is in it? Nothing, sir. To Lester. Then why did you hide it in your pocket? Let me see it. Edmund, please forgive me, father. It's a letter from my brother, Edger, that I haven't finished the reading yet, but I don't think you should read it. Gulister, let me see it. Okay. Edmund, okay, but I hope he only wrote this to test me and my loyalty to my family. Gulister, read the letter. When we respect older people too much, it makes it hard for the young to live well. Our parents keep our money from us until we are too old to enjoy it. Older people only have power because we give it to them. Come and see me, so that we can discuss this. If our father were dead, we can enjoy half his income. And be loved by your brother Edger. Did my son Edger write this letter? When did you receive this? Who brought it? Edmund? It wasn't brought to me, sir. I found it. It was thrown in through my bedroom window. Are you sure the writing is your brother's? Yes, it is his handwriting, father. Has he ever talked to you about this before? No, never. But I have often heard him say that when a son becomes an adult, he should be given some of his father's income. Oh, what a cruel son. Go and find him, Edmund. Where is he? Edmund? I don't know, father. Please, don't be angry with my brother. Let's find out what he meant. Then you can decide what to do. I am sure he wrote this to test my love and loyalty to you, and for nothing more dangerous than that. Gulister, do you really think so? Yes, listen, I have a plan. I'll hide you somewhere tonight. I'll discuss it with my brother, and you can listen to our conversation. Then you will know what he really thinks. My son cannot be so cruel to a father who loves him so much, Edmond. Find Edger and make him talk to you. I want to know the truth. I'll go and find him immediately. Find him, Edmund, and be careful to himself. What is happening? I cannot believe that Kent has been sent away. He is an honest man. It's all too strange. Jolester's exit. Edger enters. Ah, Edger, there you are. How are you? When did you last see your father? Edger. I'm well, Edmund. I saw our father last night. And did you talk to him? Yes. We spent two hours together. Did you say anything unkind to him? He is very angry with you at the moment. Please don't go near him until he is less angry. Really? Then somebody has lied about me? That's what I am worried about. Stay with me for now. I'll take you to see your father when he feels better. Here is my key. Oh, and if you go out, take your sword. My sword? But why? This is the best advice I can give you. Please, go quickly. It just exists, Edmund. My brother and the father trust me, which make them easily to deceive. I need this two fools to make my plan work. If I can't get some land in the correct way, I will have to be clever to get it.